Hey everyone, I hope all of you are doing great and you have been learning creating telegram bot and really enjoying this. So in this session, I'm going to show you how to reply to a specific message. So in telegram, we have an option of replying and then if you, rep uh, for example, let's say this is the message which you have and if I click on reply, I can reply to this particular message. Okay. And you will also see original message in the, uh, when someone is replying. Okay. So this means you are replying particular, uh, you are replying to a particular message and this is actually a great way of replying when you are using bot automation or chatbot because this is going to make sure that your bot is always replying to a specific message and there is not going to be any confusion for example let's say when you have a big group you may be seeing that you know hundreds of users replying or hundreds of users writing hi to you in a group now if your bot is replying your bot needs to know or people at least needs to know which message uh, has been replied to okay so that is the reason we are going to learn how we can reply to a specific message so uh, first of all i'm just going to run this code for a moment so we can just quickly see what is the message which we are receiving so i'm just going to write hi and we have received hello which is fine so code is working now i'm just going to scroll little down and and now here you can see this is the message which we have okay so now notice one thing under the messages under message key value pair we have something which is called message id okay so message id is always unique to one particular group so in this group or the, uh, this uh, group which we have created this message id is assigned to this message okay this message and this is always going to be unique so if i send new message it is not going to assign the same message id again to the, this message okay so that is how you make sure that it is always a unique message which has been uh, which has been sent here and when you want to reply to that unique message you need to there is a way to do that so for that what we need to do is in the send messages we are going to include reply to message id okay so i'm going to uh, use a comma here and now here in reply to message id we need to provide the message id to which we want to reply so now if you notice one thing uh, in this function we are only receiving message okay which is actually the text part of the message so now what i'm going Going to do is i'm going to change it from the text part uh, rather than the text part i'm going to change it to the complete message string okay so let me change it a bit and what i'm gonna do is i'm going to uh, here you see we have result messages so rather than this i'm just going to remove message text part so let let us pass a result which is going to be complete key value pair to here and then we are going to say text equal to and now under message we have message text which is going to be our text message which has been sent and message id is going to be under message we are going to have message id okay so this is fine now i can say reply to message is equal to message id okay so uh, many a times i'm saying equal to but that's not what i really mean so when we are saying message uh, when i'm saying reply to message id so this is a key and this is a value message id is the value for this key okay so because this is a json or this is a dictionary and dictionary always have key value pair so this looks quite okay and i hope it is going to work uh, so let's uh, run it and let's see if we it works or we get any error so i'm going to write hi and this time okay so we have received some error so just give me a moment i'm going to check why uh, why we are getting this error okay so uh, it is going to be message and then inside message it is going to be message id so my mistake there and i'm just going to run it again and this time again i'm going to write hi and now seems there is couple of uh, errors which has occurred here so that we need to fix here you can see now answer in answer earlier we were passing text so now it is message so i need to fix it as well so this is going to be text so this is going to be actually text okay and everything else looks okay now let's run it and now we can say hi okay so we have already actually received reply for hi so i'm just going to write something else i'm just gonna say hello and you can see now we are getting this reply and th uh, this is actually uh, sent as a reply to this message okay if i ask something else like uh, who created you and you can see it is answering and actually replying to this particular message okay so now this is making a lot of sense because now when a lot of people or a lot of users in this group is going to ask questions this bot is always going to make sure it is replying to that particular or that unique you know message so that's it in this lesson see you again in the next lesson